Harvard Track and Field has consistently positioned itself as one of the top teams in the Ivy League. Led by some of the region's top coaches, the Crimson has produced national champions, Ivy record holders, and numerous Olympians. It got over. During the indoor season, the Crimson called Gordon Track home. The facility sports a six-lane bank 200-meter track and an 80-yard sprint straight. Lake in lane eight. There are two long jump and triple jump pits, a pole vault runway, and multiple high jump aprons. Got over this time. Next to the track are two throwing circles and a weightlifting cage along with a facility to allow hammer, discus, and javelin training indoors. The McCurdy Outdoor Track Facility was built in 1996. It boasts an eight-lane world standard track along with double runways for jumping, throwing circles, a javelin runway, and more. The Crimson also used historic Harvard Stadium for training purposes. Built in 1903, Harvard Stadium is the oldest concrete stadium in the country and has hosted memorable track moments like the 1936 Olympic Trials. The Palmer Dixon Strength and Conditioning Center is fully equipped to train all of Harvard's varsity squads. Built in 2007, the 24,000 square foot facility boasts state-of-the-art equipment and is home to a dedicated strength and conditioning staff. Dillon Fieldhouse is home to the sports medicine facility, featuring on-site orthopedic doctors, ice baths, Ultra-G machines, and many other therapeutic resources, along with an athletic training staff to support each of Harvard's 42 varsity teams. With state-of-the-art facilities and a supportive athletic environment, Harvard Track and Field looks to continue to contend for Ivy League and national titles.